Hey everybody, I am back in the van. Uh, I had to be out for a couple of days. I really, I should be out again. You see my laptop over here. Uh, I am still on call. And for some reason, the battery has died on it. So I have to keep it plugged in. But fortunately, I have that little Suoki battery box buried down there somewhere. And uh, I can turn on the AC and I can uh, run the laptop if I get cold and have to go to work. And I'm not far from my office. If it if everything gets really out of hand, I got to be on the phone forever. I'll just uh, you know beg off a little bit and take a <coughs> excuse me, ten or fifteen minute ride back to my to my office. Uh, assuming I can find everything. Yeah, I can find everything. In any case, uh, yeah, this is the big the big television remember this other small television about 14 inches this one is 28 inches and i i got lucky it fit just perfectly see i was i was gonna get as big as i could for that area and i was thinking i ain't get a and then i was saying a 30 inch i said now let me get 28 it might give me a little clearance and it did see so voila i got a little clearance for the tv and it is a much bigger tv I'm watching Urban Stealth Camper Van Man. He's a he's a gentleman in the uh, in Great Britain. I sort of call him a brother from another mother about his attitude and how he does things. Uh, our accent is slightly accents are slightly different. His is British and mine is Texan, <laughs> American Texan, of course. And uh, so, yeah, I, I really enjoy his stuff. Anyway, I'm just sitting around. I'm cleaning out, trying to clean out some stuff because uh, I have uh, been trying to thin out the mess, believe it or not. See, all of this stuff clumped over here. I got laundry now and stuff to do I haven't done in a while. Hey, laundry. I say that once every two or three videos. Anyway, but uh, so I'm just sort of kicked back and relaxed. Uh, I guess I can reverse this thing and and uh, show just a little bit of my face if I can figure out how to do it. I so rarely show my face. I don't get a lot of uh, I don't get a lot of practice in using this this uh, the video. I'm just gonna turn it. I'm not gonna be able to see myself, so I could be looking horrible. I've got so here I am. I got my glasses on. Uh, these glasses are a little bit, uh, let's just say, uh, uh, what, would, what, what would be a good thing to turn it? A uh, little bit, a little bit, uh, anyway, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I got another pair coming that look old and, and raggedy. So, uh, uh, a brand new pair. So I'll be able to temper it with these, but I had to get some glasses because the glasses I had had broke. So I had, I got glasses in a day and, uh, from an, an online place. Cause, uh, I already had an up to date prescription. I just want to get in a hurry. So this is what I got and it does not actually fit my face that much, but eh, it's better than being blind. Anyway, let me switch this back. I hope that picture was good because I didn't turn on the reverse camera. So that could have been a horrible circumstance. So I'm just going to sit here. I need to go. Uh, I'm outside the Walmart in a place that I don't usually park. I usually park back in the corner. But I, I don't know if I'm going to do that again tonight or not. It doesn't really matter. Everybody knows that somebody's in the van. And, and, uh, and as long as you're not... Uh, outstanding in this area they're not gonna give you any crap at least they haven't here and i'm here maybe once a week twice a week sometime uh and then there, there are other areas where i stop so so i'll just worry about that later in any case uh just want to show the new uh the new tv the new battery uh the additional 155 amp hour amp hour battery i haven't figured out where the heck to place yet it's gonna be somewhere behind where this heater is or over into the corner. I think I'm gonna move it into the corner. If I could just stack it above the other two batteries, it'd be great. But I think I'm gonna to have to move the refrigerator and I've shown that before, which is, is uh, securing those, the two batteries, the two 
the, the two batteries that are on this side, there are three on the other, um, are just basically uh, up against the wall, between the wall and the refrigerator, and it's sort of all compressed, so it's, uh, it's, it's not a place where the batteries can get out. I've got some things screwed down and whatever. I'll show it better when I get the other one in, but there's no use in doing that now since I'm going to have to get the other battery probably tomorrow, UPS says. I will uh, I will place it and then worry about what I'm going to do then. I would like to have this all planned out, but, you know, some things are perfect. It's going to be 30 tonight, so I'll be using the little exhaust fan, and I'm using the... Uh, the Wave 6, and some gentleman said that the way I had the the bottle sitting was bad, so I have I have raised the bottle up, and get a bottle hanger and hang it above, not above the heater, off to the side, uh, and and the, and so it, it has more gravity feed. Um, I agree that that's probably the case, but I also know I've, I've had a Wave 6 before, never had to do that, but you know, you never know, things change. You know, maybe that's just something I just got lucky and didn't get. And, uh, and, uh, I have to get that straight. In any case, uh, thinking about buying another van. Like I said, uh, if I retire, I might get a, it will definitely be a high top van if I get it. Maybe a Ford Transit. Uh, I don't know if I'll go Mercedes Sprinter. Uh, it's just, in the States, when you get a Mercedes, you get a, you get a Sprinter which is which of course is going to be diesel it's just you don't have very many choices of where to carry it to get it repaired and you're going to pay dearly but it is a diesel and you know diesel is supposed to last like a million miles this has probably got a quarter of a million on it already uh and i haven't overhauled the engine yet if i would keep this i would or i would put a high top on this it would have to be a very high top. I'm a pretty tall guy. Uh, and then there's the box truck, the UPS style FedEx type trucks. I don't know what you, the, the, for some reason, the, the exact generic description escapes me. So I'm, I'm considering all that. Anyway, uh, that's all I've got. I think I showed my beautiful face for the first time in a while. So I think that's probably going to cover it. Hopefully this will be a good enough video for me to post. I will uh, talk to you later. And like I said, if I get the battery tomorrow, you'll be getting a video the next day, or maybe the, that evening or afternoon or the next day uh, on how I got it set up.